It's All You Can Vegas. Hey everybody, it's Derek and I'm at Tacos El Gordo on the Las Vegas Strip. Now Tacos El Gordo is one of the most popular places for tacos in Las Vegas, but this location is going to be closing soon. So let's go inside and see what there is to eat. Now normally this location is packed with a line that goes straight from the door all the way out to the Las Vegas Strip and down that way too. But now there is a second Tacos El Gordo location here on this strip just down that way. So this location is going to be closing on October 1st. I gotta say, it smells great in here. It smells like meat, <laughs> like taco meat. So the ordering process here is a little unique. You, you get in this line right here if you want the adobada or al pastor over here, asada, mula, sopes, and chorizo. And then you pay at the cashier, which is over here. And if you want fries or any of these other items like cabeza or suadero, you go down here. That is some bubbling meat that's getting chopped up. So adobada is a spicy pork, asada is steak, tripa says beef, but don't try to trick me. I've heard the adobada fries are pretty good, so I guess I'll try those. Okay, the, the fries, it says $14, but maybe there's some smaller sizes. I don't need a gigantic serving of fries with meat on it, do I? Hi, so uh, the adobada fries, uh, can you get that in like a small size? I got a small size. Okay, so I gotta order that here? Yeah. Or, or, uh, right here with me. Okay. Wanna, with everything on it? Yeah, everything. Okay, what's your name? Derek. Derek. Thank you for the water chicas para Derek. What buddy? Uh, can I also get uh, like uh, a taco uh, with asada? Asada, okay. With everything? Yeah. Anything else? That'll do it. All right, Derek, get in the middle. Okay, no. All right, so I just wait here for my order. It's being made right there in front of me. And I take it over there. Okay. Tortillas. Talk about fresh. Here we go, buddy. See yeah, the masa and everything just right there. Oh, great. Thank you very much. On the front, just pick it up. On the corner. Around the corner? Great. Thank you very much. All right, we're going to pick up our fries around the corner. Yeah, small out of butter fries. I can imagine this place gets a little hectic when it's busy right now. It's it's not as busy as I've seen it. When I've driven past here down the strip, I mean, there's people all over the place waiting in line and eating inside and eating outside. Not too bad right now. I think I see my, my fries getting made right there, freshly made. Yeah. 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 I don't know, but maybe those are my fries over. I don't know why they're going over there, because I'm over here. I guess those are my fries. Or maybe he's putting the the adobada meat on them. That's what he's doing. He's putting the adobada meat over there. And, that, and now they're going to top it off with all the, all the extra toppings, whatever they may be. I hope that's mine. It looks so good. Okay, thank you. Oh, whew, for a second, I thought I wasn't going to get them. All right. This looks good. Let's see. And they've got a, a condiment bar here. Radishes, limes, and more radishes. Alright, I've got my food. I've paid for it. The price was $10.93. That's including tax. And 
I've got an asada taco and some auto lot of fries. Let's check out these fries. Look at this. I guess it's some kind of uh, green sauce and sour cream and cheese. And there's pork. All fresh chopped. You can hear it being chopped right over there. Take a look at this taco. That is a fresh handmade taco right off the grill, right off the chopping block. Let's see how it tastes. I guess that's what you get when you say you want everything on it. That's what it looks like anyway. Wow, that's just good basic Mexican taco flavors right there. Like, I, this tastes about as authentic as I think you're gonna get. Just look at these. There's like, <laughs> there's gotta be so many magical flavors in there. That's what it looks like to me, like pure magic. All right. sweetness in here. I don't know if it's the, the fries or the toppings or the meat. Let's try the meat. Oh, that's good. It's kind of like chili cheese fries, except better. I've never had anything that tastes like this before. I think, I don't think I've ever had adobada before. It must be what it is. Look at all the, the, the different components of this. I mean, there's so much flavor going on here. Well, now I understand the hype about Tacos El Gordo. I mean, for the longest time I've heard about this place. Never came by. Now I'm here right before they're getting ready to close forever. Well, just this location. <laughs> but I mean, I assume the food's gonna be just the same down the, down the street. It's just down the block. It's on the same street. It's just like less than a block down the street. So if you've been to this location before, well, then you know where it is. And you know what it is. And what it is is pretty amazing. I mean, if you can handle all the chop, chop, chopping in the background, this is a pretty great place to eat. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. Please give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think about Tacos El Gordo. And be sure to subscribe for more because there's always more to eat when it's all you can bake. It's.